These are tricolor hognose snake eggs. One of them went bad and one of them was never fertile. Let's cut them open and see what's inside. This first egg made it to about day 10 of incubation and then it went bad. As you can see, when I cut open the egg, a lot of yolk came spilling out. When I peeled the shell back, some of that yolk had already solidified. This often happens when fertile eggs go bad during incubation. This egg also had a pretty terrible smell to it. After I peeled the shell completely off, you could see a little brown or pinkish spot. This spot is the embryo. This is what would develop into a baby snake if the egg survived. The rest of the solidified mass is the yolk. Over the course of about 60 days, the embryo would consume that yolk in order to nourish itself and grow into a fully functioning baby snake. Now that we saw what's inside of a fertile egg that went bad, let's take a look at an infertile egg, also known as a slug. Similar to the first egg, when I cut this one open, a lot of yolk came spilling out. But it didn't have that same terrible smell. And you could see here that nothing had solidified. It's all just runny yolk. And there's also no embryo in this egg. So this egg never had a baby growing inside. So now we know what the inside of a fertile egg that has gone bad looks like and the inside of an infertile egg. In about 40 days, the healthy eggs from this clutch should start hatching. So stick around to see some baby tricolor hognose snakes hatching.